Greetings, and welcome to part one of our series covering the CA Workload Automation AE Software Development Kit. In this module, I will be demonstrating some key steps to getting started with the Autosys SDK. We will also very quickly review a basic example application. The Java application will use the ping API method to connect to the workload automation application server. Specifically, we will cover prereqs, required libraries, imports, the Java logger, and we will end with a quick code review, build, and run. I will start by using the Red Hat Package Manager to verify that I have my required components, the WAAE client and SDK. Taking a quick look under dollar autosys, there is a code directory that contains several samples as well as header files. Moving back to the dollar autosys live directory, it contains the libraries we need to include in our application, asapi.jar and the log4j jar. Okay, we are ready to put together the program. I'm using NetBeans for this demo and I'll just create a new project, give it a name, ping API, now to add the libraries I mentioned earlier, and next some imports, the main connection service, some constants that we will need, and the Java logger. Going to add a client class in a new file and add some more imports, the main connection service again, the exception class for our try catch block, and finally the ping API request and response services. The Java logging facility can be configured by adding this line to the main function as shown. We will also need to set up the referenced log.properties file in our working directory. Reviewing the code in the main function, we configure the logger, check command line arguments, which are the app server host and port, and finally the connection is established and the request is made. In our client source file there is simply the constructor and its sole method which establishes the request and processes the response. Now let's build it and see it in action. And there we go. Success. Thank you for watching.